Hi everybody, it's Nani. How you doing? I am wonderful. I am back with a Dollar Tree finds and fails. And yes, everything in here is from the Dollar Tree and I believe everything was $1.25. If it wasn't $1.25, I'll let you know. I don't buy a lot of the plus stuff. There's one store pretty close to us now that has the plus items area and I don't think I've bought anything from that at all yet. And then we do have a couple stores that have the plus freezer section. And I do buy things from the freezer area, but I don't show it very often. So if there is anything in here from that, I'll let you know, but I don't think there is. We may as well start with this before it falls off. You guys know we love trying the drinks from the Dollar Tree. And I just showed this recently, and I think I taste tested it when I showed it. This was the vitamin water, zero sugar, and it says, with love, raspberry dark chocolate. This was really good. I could not taste the, the, the dark chocolate at all. To me, it just tasted and smelled like red raspberries, and it was good. And Hubby could taste the dark chocolate, and he liked it. So it's just weird, really weird how people's taste buds are different. He could, I could not. But we would pick this up again. It was good. And wonderful. And I know there's another drink here right on top. Hubby just had this and I tried it just yesterday. And this is very good as well. I couldn't drink a lot of this because I do believe there is stevia in it. And this is the Body Armor Light. And it says low calorie, zero sugar added. And it's the blueberry pomegranate. I do believe there is stevia. Let's see if I can read quickly here. If not, I'm not going to spend the time. Yes, there is. But it says natural flavor, sweeteners, coconut water, electrolytes, and it has 700 milligrams of potassium. Total blend, whatever that means, is 820 milligrams. Antioxidants, B vitamins, zero sugar. Hubby really liked this a lot. I did taste it, and the flavor is great. So he would pick this up again. And I think it's a pretty good deal for $1.25 because you would pay way more for this somewhere else. And then I finished a thing of my Q-tips. These are my go-to. These are the Assured brand and they're the 200 count with the paper sticks. I love the paper sticks. These are the 300 count with the plastic sticks. I don't like them. They just, some of them in this package for some reason, and this has happened to me several times, not just one time. It's like they don't have a lot of cotton on some of their ends. Let me see. I don't know if you can see that. It's like you probably can't tell that from that distance. But it's almost like sometimes there'll be a nice amount of cotton. Other times there is nothing. You know, and you go to clean your ear and you feel that plastic stick. So I'm not throwing these away. I will put them down in the craft room and use them for crafting, but I won't buy the 300 count with the plastic stick again. I will stick with the 200 count with the um, paper stick. So yeah, so this I'll just sit here off to the side so I can take it downstairs. And these, I, they're not finished yet, I, but I used one. So I put it in here to go ahead and show you. These are the um, Scrub Buddies, the three pack of the deep, cleaning pad refills and these are the kind of pads that like go on the bottom of a Swiffer like attach with Velcro which Dollar Tree does have that attachment head and I need one of those because mine the Velcro is getting kind of old and it, it didn't stick as well as it should but I don't blame this for it I blame the actual attachment because I use it so so much I used one of these to scrub the floors these are great you just use your own cleaner, your own water, and it worked great. It held up the entire time that I was scrubbing. I scrubbed two bathrooms. I scrubbed our kitchen, the little hallway we have, the front room, the front foyer. I cleaned it all with one of these. It held up well. It did its job. It picked up dirt. I would buy these again. I would recommend these. And this isn't the kind that you can fold around and then, you know, stick it in the little slots. This one is actual like Velcro. So yeah, I would, I definitely would buy these again. It worked great. 
I'm going to set that off to the side and put it away. We finished a thing of the JJ's Bakery mini apple pies made with real fruit. You get three little pies in here. These are amazingly delicious. I did find the cherry ones and put them away for when Harper and London come down because I know that Harper will love them. But I didn't try those yet. But these apple ones, they're good. And I saw one of you comment here in one of my last videos that um, you had got a box and there was barely any apples in it, that it was mostly like the, the jelly part. I don't know what you want to call that, but I've never had that problem. I've They've always had a ton of apples in and they're just tasty and good. And they're not super big. They're you know smaller than the palm of your hand. So they're the perfect little snack size, which there's still a bazillion calories in it. 210 calories in one little pie, but they're delicious. And I would buy these again, absolutely. All oh, me and hubby finished one of these. These are out right now in the stores. They're the Oli Raw, the um, breakfast biscuits. This was in the flavor hazelnut carob. We both really liked this. I think this is great. And you guys are saying that they're like $10 in other stores for one box of these. And these are organic. And it says USDA organic, non-GMO, sustained energy from ancient Greek grains. And you get four packs in here with three in each pack. And they are nice, thick size biscuits in each pack. And the whole pack of those, of three, it's only 180 calories, and they're very filling. So we still have the two other flavors that I want to go ahead and try. So I think that's a great deal. I like this flavor a lot. And then we finished a thing of my razors. These are my favorite razors at the Dollar Tree. These are the Barbasol brand, Classic 2, and you get five razors in here with two blades. I love these. These are my favorite razor. I never have a problem, knock on wood, never have a problem shaving my legs. There are some razors out there that just slice my legs to shreds and I stick with these. I do try other ones. I always go back to the Barbasol. If they work well for a man's face, I know they're gonna work well on my legs. They're great. I finished a thing of the paper towels. These are out right now, I believe. They're a bigger roll. They're 25% more. Paper towels, instead of 140 sheets, this one is 176 sheets. These are like the custom custom size. I like these. They work well for us. I keep picking them up. They, they work great. Hubby made some muffins. If there's another pack in here I was looking for. One day he decided to make some muffins, so he made two different flavors. These are the Martha White brand. This was the chocolate chip muffin mix, just add milk. And this was the blueberry muffin mix, just add milk. And the directions said, I believe, to use a um, like the mini muffin tin pans. I do have one downstairs, but he didn't do that. He used just the regular muffin size. And he got six really nice size muffins using the regular muffin size. So he got six of each. These are good guys. And he did add extra berries to this one. We had some blueberries here and he threw in some extra blueberries. This one, I believe he threw in some extra chocolate chips. They were delicious. Very good. We'd buy them again. And this was a hubby thing. This was the Simply Asia spicy Kung Pao noodle bowl. And it was a hot one. I didn't even try this, but he loved it said it was really good. Every one of these that he has tried, he has really liked. And they had several different flavors in the stores right now. I picked these up a while back and we used them, ate them. This is the Wild Fair Provisions of the Mediterranean Soil and Sun. These were the dried organic mango slices, non-GMO, USD organic, and it was four ounces, no sugar added, and on the ingredients list, it says organic mango slices. That's it. These were good. I am not a super big mango fan, but I could eat these. They were they were good. They weren't super crispy, hard, just nicely dried. Very good. And there's a whole list of stuff here on the back. USD or, Day Organic, non-GMO, vegan, no sugar added. It says there is an American flag there. 
but I can't read what it says around it. Processed in the USA, I believe is what that says. So I'm not sure where the mangoes are from. Packed in the USA with Peruvian mangoes. So the mangoes are from Peru. But these were good. I finished a thing of my little lithium batteries, the button batteries. This is the CR2032. It's the battery size that goes in all my clickers. And it's a two pack for $1.25. I think that's great. I would spend a lot more somewhere else on the button batteries. So I try anything that I have that needs button batteries. I always look at the Dollar Tree first to see if they have that size because you can get the button batteries like teeny weeny ones, five or six in a pack for $1.25. So check there first before you go somewhere else. And then I was eating these for a couple days. These are the Beduco Choco Biscuits, a 2.8 ounce. They're the little like shortbread cookies with a nice layer of chocolate on the top. Very fancy looking, very pretty cookie. These would be great on a cookie tray, charcuterie board. These are good, guys. They're a very like basic cookie. Very simple flavor to the actual shortbread part of it, but that chocolate is just flavorful and delicious. Very, very nice cookie. I would buy these again, definitely. Baduco bread. And then we finished off one of these. They are the Quaker Chewy Fruity Fun Granola Bars in the Splendid Strawberry, and I think it says six. You got six bars in here. I like these a whole lot, and I also like... They have, I have them in the cabinet right now, opened this same thing. It took me forever to find them, but I did in, I don't know if it's apple cinnamon, apple something. They are delicious as well. And I do still see these lingering around in my stores. So if you see them, grab them. They're great. Kids are going to be getting out of school for the summer and kids like snacks. And at least that one is a little bit more on the healthy side. We finished one of the apple snacks, the four pack unsweetened applesauce. No sugar added. And there were the four like individual cups in here. We love having these on hand. They work well for me and hubby instead of opening a big jar of applesauce and then it just sitting in the refrigerator. If we want an applesauce, we just have these little, you know, one of these little cups. They're great. And I, these are a product of Canada. They're so good. Oh, another thing of water we tried and I didn't get to try this. I, this is the one that I really wanted to open. And one day I had laid down to take a nap and the hubby had it. He drank it. He didn't realize that I wanted to try this flavor. And it was the Ready Protein Water. 15 grams of protein, zero sugar, five electrolytes for hydration. And this is in the flavor Orange Mango. 100% protein isolate, free from erythritol and sucralose, natural flavors and sweeteners, functional hydration, muscle recovery, and it's a 16.9 ounce. He really liked this a lot. He liked the flavor, so we would buy this again, but I am on the hunt for it because I want to try it, and it does say lactose-free, so yeah, he liked it, and oh, guys, you guys got me on these things, and they're so good. These seriously are delicious. These are the Albanese gummies. They're the mini gummy butterflies. And they also have them in sour. They have them in like regular gummy bears, the worm shape in regular flavors and sour. I don't like the sour ones. It's a 3.5 ounce little pouch, which you get a lot in the bag. These are good. So good. And they're not hard. Like Harry Bows to me are so hard. It's like you break your jaws trying to chew those things. And these aren't. They're a softer. They're good. So good. And I had actually seen that you can go to their website and order bags of just one particular flavor. You know, if you like just the grape flavor, you can order bags of just those flavors. I am going to check that out. Oh, here's another one of these that hubby tried. This is the Thai Kitchen, the Thai Peanut Rice Noodle Cart. Pre-cooked rice noodles and sauce with vegetables and topping. It is in the medium heat and it's ready in three minutes and it's a 9.77 ounce bowl. I remember showing this and it was a heavy bowl. You get a lot of noodles in here and he enjoyed this as well. 
so yeah, finished another one of those. And he, he must have had a like Chinese Thai type thing because here's the Bibigo, the Korean style steamed dumplings. This is the pork and vegetable. Was this from the plus section or is this a regular $1.25 guys? I cannot remember, but I know they're in the stores quite a bit. I apologize. I can't remember what this one was. But I know this comes in chicken and vegetable as well, but he likes the pork. And you get six really nice size dumplings, plus the, I, I think it's soy sauce. I'm not quite sure what the sauce is. And he really likes this. They call this a dipping sauce, a tangy soy vinegar dipping sauce. He likes this a whole lot. And with it, he had the pork pot stickers. This is by Imperial Garden. And it was a nine count, 5.5 ounce. He really enjoyed these as well. And then I finished a jar of my paste picante. Do you guys know what I made with it? I know a lot of you do. I, this is one of my favorite things to keep on the shelf. And I fry pork chops, a little bit of butter, a little bit of salt and pepper, but you don't even need to do the, the salt and pepper at all because this is so flavorful. I have just fry my pork chops till they're nice and golden brown, put a jar of this over top, let it simmer for about 20 minutes or so, serve it like that. Have it with noodles, have it with rice, have it with fried potatoes, whatever. It is good. This is just delicious and it's nice to have on hand. And it's the paste mild. I like the mild. I believe it also comes in hot and medium, but I like the mild and it is an eight ounce jar. It's amazing. Quick, easy, fast supper. It tastes good. And plus it's very low carb too, if you're doing low carb. Had a thing of the Spam Single Classic. Either you love Spam or you hate it, and we love it. And it is by Hormel Foods, 2.5 ounce. And it's just like a, a slice of Spam. It's very good. We like Spam, fry it up. I like mine fried and fried till it's crispy, crispy, crispy. And hubby can eat it just plain and he likes it that way quick, easy snack, quick, easy lunch. Um, I finished a thing of the baby wipes. I always have baby wipes on hand. And these I actually put in, I have a, um, a an old canister from another type of wipe and I can't, are there, are there ready wipes? They're a white canister with like red and blue and white print on the front. I just put these in there and it keeps them fresher longer and I keep them in the vehicles. And this is what I use. And then if I use these, I'll actually add a little bit of rubbing alcohol. And I use them to wipe, wipe down cart handles, that type of stuff. And there's 72 wipes in here, paraben-free, alcohol-free, chlorine-free, fragrance-free. And they are a five and a half by 7.8 inch wipe. And I like to have these here just in the house as well. You know, having grandchildren around, it's great to have. These work great. They're nice, they're thick, they stay moist. And then I'm not sure if this is still in the store. Hubby picked this up a while back and it's an eyeglass cleaner and he really likes this. It's the eyeglass, the I think it's luxury brand is the name of the company. TSM brands, but it says luxury eyeglass cleaner, safe for anti-reflective glass, plastic and polycarbonate lenses, 8.4 ounce. It's a nice big spray bottle of it. And he actually has a little tiny spray bottle that he refills. And then he uses that when we travel, things like that. But this lasted a very long time and he liked it. It works well. And I think I've said, I'm a person that just uses my shirt or a tissue or whatever to clean mine. And then the last thing, guys, the bucket's empty. I had to tell you guys about these again. If you see these, get them. It is the Eno's brand, the Trap and Kill Spider and Insect Trap made in the USA. You get two traps in here and people have been asking me questions. You get two traps. I actually set them in the freezer for a few minutes first to just help take that paper off because the sticky part is very sticky. And then when you take it out of the freezer, you just pull that sheet, that protective paper sheet off, throw that away. And then you can either fold them up they, they kind of fold up into a triangle shape. You probably can't see by that, but you know what I mean. It kind of folds up like that sticky side inside. I didn't do that. I just took the, the paper sheet off and I just left them laying flat. 
with the sticky side up. I just put them in, you know, the corners and the dark areas just with the sticky side up. Side up. Now, if it's in an area where you're going to be wa walking a lot, I'd make sure you, you know, either put it up in the triangle shape. You don't want to step on it because it will definitely stick to your foot. But these work great. And no, I haven't seen any more of the big spiders. None. Got two. One I did myself. And then the other one, I caught it as soon as I put the trap down. And I've caught a few teeny little bugs on it, but nothing else. Knock on wood. Thank goodness. But these work great. I highly, highly, highly recommend them. I think I have seven packages of those just down on the shelf just to have because you just never know when you're going to need one somewhere you know or if, my, if my kids whatever want them i have them but all right guys that is it that is this i've been doing it what about every two weeks now of finds and fails i found some good stuff i don't i don't think there was anything that i really did not like other than that 300 count of those q-tips with the plastic stick i just never have any luck with those so like i said i'll just go ahead and use them for crafting all right i hope you guys are doing well if you like this type of thing please subscribe i'd love to have you as part of my youtube family you guys are the best have a great day everybody and i'll talk to you again here really soon peace